Oh, Mr. Smith. You're super cool. Jim Krantz is in here. This one's had some moisture inside, not a lot. But you can see it in the hands there. It's pretty serious loom damage on the hour and the minute hands, well, and the sweep hand too. I've had good luck bringing these back, um, so I'm sure I can clean that loom up. It, I'm not going to be able to bring it back to, like, full white. I just, I'm not going to be able to. I don't think. Chrome should be okay. Markers should be okay. I should be able to clean those up. It's, uh, so we've got some revital loom treatment stuff that we need to do. This was definitely somebody's watch. You can see the case back is worn. Okay, back is on nice and firm. See what we got. Show me what you got. It's dirty inside there. I don't see any servicing marks. Darn it. Yeah, early one. Hmm? Big slab sided 6119 flat plate movement the orange text she's a runner your lower mainspring arbor port is junk you can see right here see all the brassing around the edge of the mainspring barrel that's because the mainspring arbor which is the hole this is the mainspring arbor it's like the axle that the whole mainspring barrel turns on that's this screw on the top of it this is the ratchet wheel this winds the mainspring the hole in the top here has a bushing. Actually, it looks just like that. There is a, there is the upper bushing. And there is no bushing on the bottom. It's just a hole in the main plate. And what we do is I machine that out. And we put in a jewel there. And the top bushing we press out. And we put in a jewel there. So your watch goes from being 21 jewels to 23 jewels, which is pretty neat. I think that's a lot of fun. But what you can see is the lower hole is so worn out that the whole barrel is tipping and it's grinding on the underneath of the the main of uh, the train bridge, barrel and train bridge. Movement doesn't look bad though. Your hairspring looks clean. I don't really there no water really didn't get into your movement. So it looks like we're going to need Functional cleaning, mainspring arbors, and then cosmetic cleaning to get these hands a little better and dial a little better, but really not much. Uh, I see that the loom is gone from in back of your loom pit. It's the, the window is still there, which is great. You still got it. I can mimic the original loom color and loom that for you if you'd like, or I can just leave it be. Nice thing about looming it is it will fix that little window in place because those get lost, which is no fun. So if it were my watch, I would, I would use my Vinta loom and I would loom on the back of that um, and, and as well as cleaning up the dial and, and doing my best to clean up the hand loom. But Really beyond that, not mess with it too much. I don't know. You tell me. I think it seems pretty straightforward. Okay. Thank you very much.